Hi, this is Rick Hansen on Getting Excited, the 20th practice of my book, Just One Thing. Obviously, it's not appropriate or even possible sometimes to get excited if you're ill or exhausted and so forth, but under normal conditions, we all have a natural aliveness, a natural vitality, and if we don't experience it and express it, after a while, life starts feeling really flat, inert, beige, blah. So, if you can, maybe pick one thing that is naturally exciting for you, uh, but maybe it's lost some of its pep or zip, and see if there's some ways to turn up the volume a little bit. Maybe cooking in a new way, uh, maybe doing some more things physically, uh, or doing them with more um, energy, uh, maybe looking for some new things to do sexually, perhaps, whatever it is. Look for some area to stir up the um, excitement. And in particular, see if you can really give yourself permission to be excited. A lot of us got negative messages about being excited when we were young. Look, we were too much for other people. So see if you can you know, acknowledge those messages and let them go. And may you be excited.